Okay, I'm making a, I'm gonna make a, a purse. It's gonna have elk hair and uh, leather. It's gonna be brain tan and smoked. And so what I got here is a piece of the, well I showed the pattern. I don't know if I've ever done a video on making a pattern, but they're pretty simple. You just figure out what you want to uh, make the design you want to do and then you go in and draw it out on a piece of cardboard like I had a piece top of cardboard here. or front this is going to be the front it's got uh, 62 holes around through here it's 11 by 11 I rounded off the corners and then this is going to be that's going to be made out of leather let me show you a piece of that this is a piece of the leather, flesh side, high, uh, hair side, and it's nice and soft. So the first thing I want to do is take my my uh, front cover here, position it on my piece of leather. A little waist in, so I get as close to the edge as I can here. Which you know, I have to straighten it out. Take my pencil, go around. <laughs> Okay, and I'll come back later and mark all the holes when I get this piece cut out. So let's get it cut. And now, start cutting. I start cutting a little bit here. And it's like a fabric, so soft. Okay, turn this piece off here. So I want to line up my front of my first here with a pattern. Mark all the holes. Try something different. A little quicker way to punch holes right here. Got this piece of sand, sandstone. The sandstone is going to help me break these hides. I've been working a little bit on it just to see how it's going to go. These are 
part of the leg of the elk. Beautiful pieces of with the fur on, hair on. So I've already got them tanned. I'm just stretching them. They're still a little bit wet. I tanned them with uh, egg yolks. And uh, they're a little bit stiff around the edges and corners, but they're getting there and I'm working on them. So this sandstone like this is rub it briskly and hard like sandpaper basically Take the edge of it to the board, and then I let me move this up over these holes here and make it hard. It's painter's tape, and then I just mark down where I wanted to start the lines at, and the way it to come down. Brain tan deer hide. And all you gotta do is come over a quarter inch each cut with a sharp edge. Got a little razor blade here. See how easy that cuts that? Come down another quarter inch. right and then for the holes in this I'll just take a gnaw and punch through because it's thin enough I can do that this one I had to have a hole punch all these holes There's, this is such a thick piece but it's nice and soft this one's a little more stiffer but I'll overlap it like this and I'll run a stitch across there got my uh, fringe turned the right way See it goes inside like this when I turn it inside out it'll be out. So uh, got my thong ready here. Got a sharp edge to see. Yeah. Somewhat sharp edge on that. Just a little dab of glue on there. See if I make it stiffer. <laughs> 